The first is mandatory access control. As opposed to discretionary, there is a mandatory set of rules that everyone must abide by, referred to as MAC or MAC controls in some cases. It is rule-based access control. Now this rule-based access control means that data owners have far less freedom than with the previous example, discretionary access control. The access is granted based on rules. Now this is where the security labels come into play. The labels we talked about a little bit earlier are used extensively in higher secured environments or environments that require more security than just basic user and group IDs. Every resource has a specified label and every user has a specified clearance and those are matched up. The subject security clearance is compared to the object's security label. This is very often implemented in tables in tabular form 